Hey guys, this is Lisa Lee. Let's get back into the game, shall we? Oh, right away. We already got a side thing. I already forgot what it's called. Young wizard, please come see me at the library at once. It is a matter most urgent. Oh, okay. Jesus. Day two. Or part two, whatever. Whatever you want to see it as. You? I still need to do you. Oh, you like my little hood? It didn't show up in the other one, though. There it is. Alright, what about this one? Ooh. I'll cook this one. This is more green style. This one I could probably sell. Quick sell. How much will that give me, though? Oh, well, I'm not even gonna see to find out. Ooh, look at that. Doesn't even match my outfit, but that's okay. So, okay, we just got done talking to that guy over there. And we need to take care of... We need to go to, um... This angel goddess lady. Oh, thank you. Like I said before, there's gonna be a lot of running around, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. It's gonna be very annoying. Yeah, we need to go through this door. Talk to this Lady Oriel. Ooh, God, hi. Fairies flying around. Goddess of, of fairies, jeez. Oh, praise the light. Someone has come at last. Something has been corrupting my fairies. Since you have come in my hour of need, use this in future battles. Thank you for coming at this dark time. If you are as brave as you look, I know you will help save my fairies. I hope so. Please go out to Unicorn Way and defeat some of these evil fairies. Collect the dust that they drop. With that, I will be able to tell you more about their corruption. Okay. I know it is a dark task, but it must be done. Take care, wizard. I like how they say wizards instead of the name. I think you need to update the game a little. Oh, hi, person. Edward Swiftmancer. Caleb and Jester Hat. Off I go. Hey, Dark Fairy, come here. Come here. Hello. I want to battle you. There we go. Oh, there it is, a wooden chest. Like what I said before in the other episode. Oh, she got it. Oh well. Poof! And she dropped fairy dust. Eh, hey, victory dance. And I wonder I didn't see the golden or the golden chest. Ha! <laughs> Wooden chest. Because other people have been taking them. Oh well. Dark fairy. Hello. I would like to battle you and collect your fairy dust. Oh, jeez. Hi, fairies. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Am I in your way? <laughs> oh. Hey. There we go. Let me get your attention so I may battle you. Ooh. Ooh. Rough 
rough sponge. Get on there. <laughs> He's just following the fairy queen. Oh well. Ooh, let me see this. Let me see. Rough sponge shoes. Different colors. <laughs> Plus three max. Oh, I mean, whatever works. Lady Oriel! I'm done! Right, I need to go back to the other guy because I defeated fairies too. You have returned with the fairy dust. Please give it to me so that I can investigate the reason for their corruption. Lady Oriel looks visibly shaken. Uh oh, what's happening? They have been enchanted by something that is undead. This does not bode well. How has evil become so brazen in this place? These are dark times indeed. I have heard that someone has hung bone cages along the street. I fear these are being used to trap my fairies and corrupt them. Oh no, what shall we do? Please, you must free the captured fairies from those horrible bone cages before they become corrupted. Go quickly, my friend. Okay. Oh god. Please do not point that in her butt. Never again. Ooh, you have a dragon. Why did they spin around? That happened a lot before. They just spin around like, woo! Like, oh, they're spinning around a lot. Like, ooh, don't you get dizzy after once in a while? You know? I mean, it's, it's really annoying. Hey! <laughs> I was gonna do that. I'm getting this next one. There, I got this one. Here, you know what? I will cross the street so that we each got it. Uh huh. Now go find something else. Oh, razor over there. Good. Three out of four. Okay, one more. Oh, not that one. Bone cage. Yay! Now it's back to Lady Oriel. Oh, yeah, I had something in my backpack. Healer shoes. Oh, but it's. it's uh... Oh, there we go. That might match my hood. Seriously? Oh. I only have three imps and six of these. Um, well now. I need more spells. Okay, back to Lady Oriel. Once again. You hear a tiny, joyful voice call your name. Oh, oh, cutie. Oh my goodness. Thank you for helping out the fairies. They did not mean to be evil, but the corruption made them do bad things. Is it just me or am I seeing two? <laughs> now there is hope again, and the fairies will be able to bring magic and cheer to the people of Wizard City once more. Thank you, Wizard. Oh, you're welcome. You know, you have like uh, another fairy stuck to your, you. Um, we may need to get that checked out. Oh! Jeez, what did you do to me? I don't remember that. Seriously, dude, what are you doing? Uh, oh well. Let's go over here. We thank you, wizard. The freed fairies have already told me of your heroism. Your deeds will be remembered here on Unicorn Way. Oh, no problem. And to show my appreciation, here is a healing spell. <gasps> Remember oh! to add it to your deck so it will aid you in your time of need. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Thank you! We must now find oh. out who is behind the corruption. 
My fairies whispered of a monster whose bones made a clacking sound as it came for them. Really? Tell me more. Saren Nightchant knows Unicorn Way very well. He will know if there is a sinister skeleton that now haunts my street. Okay, I'll go back to him then. Farewell, Alexander and Mr. Bandit. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. You're, um... Yeah, okay. Oh, wooden chest! It's fine. Ten gold. That's it. Well, I'm just a beginner, so, okay. I'll take it. I know at some point I'm gonna have to fight that fairy queen. Unicorn Park, thank you. Back in the gazebo. Oh, jeez. I got the gazebo. Hey! Lady Oriole sent you to investigate the corruption of the fairies? I will gladly tell you what I know. Oh. Well, thank you, Sir Siren. Well, Mr. Nightchant. Better, how are you say that name? When the dark fairies began to show up, I had suspected Lady Black Hope. But even she has never tried to enchant fairies before. Lady Black Hope. Then the fairies gave report of a skeleton? Of course! Who else could it be but Rattlebones? Rattlebone, of course, that guy. Since I grew up here, I know a lot. I do not know yet what Dark Master has aided him, but Rattlebones has taken over my old friend Delia's tower. Oh, okay. Find him in the tower and stop him from making any more cages. Please, do what you can to save the fairies. I will. And I'm off. Once again. Here I go. What do you have? Oh my god, what kind of animal is that? Is that, is that a, a, a Loch Ness monster? Oh! And of course she's got a mount. Obviously. <laughs> Hello, how you doing? Obviously bought in the store. Cause you can't really get that in the, uh, 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 the town stores. You need to actually go online and buy them. With your crowns, obviously. Or you can, uh, buy them with your real money if you want. But I try not to do that. Oh well, let's go to Rattlebones. In this tower that's obviously got the window colored blue. You cannot stop us, wizard. The corruption of the fairies is just the beginning of Manister's plans. Soon, Wizard City will fall, and there isn't anything anyone can do about it. <laughs> we'll see about that. Oh, wait a minute. Before I do that, what is, um, my deck? Ooh! Well, there you go. It's automatically in my deck. Okay, I'm ready. <sighs> you know, I'll get rid of the dark fairy first. The less the players. Oh, jeez. Oh. Oh. Both of you suck. Um. Yeah, this one. What did they say before? Get rid of the players, the less, less problem you have. Oh god. Oh! You see that? She lifted me! Took part of my soul! Oh, I don't have any more imps. I'm gonna have to wait for later. Take that, Rattlebones! 
Oh god. Oh. <laughs> oh god, he's got a shiny sword. That's not fair. What is this? 420? Ooh, yeah. Dying? Oh! Yeah, let's just uh, hit you with one of these. Oh! Steel like. Oh, what did I get? Novus's robe. I need to see this. Oh, it's a fire. It's 22 max. Oh boy. Maybe? There we go. <laughs> I'm so colorful. And I'm in attack mode. Get out of attack mode. Okay, out we go. Where do I go next? Oh yeah. Now I need to visit this guy. And here we are again. I do. I finished the quest. You did it! Now the fairies will sing again! You bested that wretched skeleton rattle bones! I wish that was the end of our troubles in Wizard City, but I'm afraid a more sinister evil is still out there. Oh. What else is there? Thanks to you, wizard, oh, Unicorn Way is in less danger than it was. But we are still not out of the dark woods yet. Uh, yeah, okay. Whoa. Yeah, sure, whatever. I got fairy shoes! Oh my gosh. And I got a new wand. There's one card. One card each. You should report our progress to Headmaster Ambrose. The news about Rattlebones may help him determine what doom has come to Wizard City. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna head there now. Let's do it! What do you want, Mr. Big Butt? You got a minute? I'm worried. I haven't seen my friend Private Orion in a while. Oh yeah, sure. We both grew up here, you see, and he just wanted to make sure the skeletal pirates hadn't gotten into his old house. Oh, okay. He could be trapped in the house, but I can't leave my post. Please find him and help him get back to safety. Oh, sure. He's in unicorn away. Okay, well, off I go again. Olivia, what do you want? Sweet old lady. The other day, while I was walking down Unicorn Way, I noticed a tall man leaving the area. As he hurried down the street, he dropped this book. Oh, what is it? I yelled at him to stop, but he did not seem to hear me. It is strange. It looks rather sinister. And I am not able to open it. Really? Could you take it to the library in the commons? Maybe Boris knows who owns it. Maybe he might know how to open it. He knows much about enchanted books. Of course. I will do that. Alright, peeps. Look for a house with... Oh, there it is. <laughs> All the way down there. My skeleton. Here we are. Oh, hello. Knock, knock. It's me, a wizard. Oh, Private Orion. Hello. Well, aren't you a type for sore eyes? Oh, uh, uh, do I know you? By the way, you're like two, two, two times taller than me. Uh, otherwise, I'm just a midget. It's anyway. good to be back in my old house now that I've cleared oh. it of skeletal pirates. Unfortunately, now there are too many outside. I'm stuck. Oh, I'm sorry. 
If you defeat enough of those skeletal pirates, I can make a run for it. You'd be a lifesaver. Sure. Well, Shadow Blood. Would I like to join? Well, I mean, I'm kind of doing something else for myself right now, but let's see here. Bye! Let's go defeat a skeletal pirate. Oh, no, 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 no. Not you. Oh, let me defeat you real quick. Hey! How's it going? Oh, we'll defeat the scary in no time. <laughs> Ow! Oh, I resisted it. Oh. <laughs> oh, I did a fizzle. Let me just hit you. <sighs> what you waiting for? Girl. Eh. Ew! Yuck. Ha, there you go. And he skips because I don't know what the frack he was doing. Imp to you. Oh, there he goes. Oh. <laughs> You both suck. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Um, why didn't I see that before? You need to heal. Do not go towards him. Even touch that skeleton. Do, 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 do. We're all just going around like da 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 da. Okay, well, you're welcome. On the uh, healing. Okay, now let me let me do the skeleton. A fizzle. Oh. 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 Oh.
Ooh, I got a ghost touch and I got a fur lined hood. Oh my goodness. Fur lined. Oh, oh. Okay, good. It's white. That looks amazing on my head. I got a fairy's wand. Should I? Yeah, I should. Cause I got it. So here, equip that. Yay! I got another stick. I mean, yeah, that's awesome. Another stick. Let's defeat more of you guys. Ooh, there you go. Put a little thunder in there. Ow! Plit! Oops! I mean, hey, it's my first spell. Hi, kitty! Oh! That one, uh. Oh, that's a scar on my face. Oh, take that! Da -da -da -da. Okay. A little dark magic here and there, a little hocus pocus, and. <laughs> Reaction was kind of early, skeleton. Yeah, it's two gold. Yay. Two gold out of that. Okay, let's go for another one. Another one. Hello. Alright. Third time's charm? Kill and creep up to me. Oh. Oh, that is powerful. Yay! Ghost touch. Wait, am I done with that quest? Oh, okay, I am done with that, so I didn't need to do that last skeleton. Okay, well, here I go. Oh, buddy. Yeah, you better stop. Wizard Crossing. Try it, Orion! Thanks for clearing the way, wizard. I should be able to make it back all right. Cool. Thanks for checking on me. Tell Private Connolly I'm doing well. Great. You have a crystal ball? I'm not gonna. Never mind. Okay. Scooting away. Hello. O Glad to hear Orion is doing well. O Connolly, sorry. Say, can you check up on someone for me? Another person? I usually see Dorothy out shopping by now, but I fear she's too afraid to leave home. Oh, sure. Ooh, fairy cloak. Oh, cool. She's just down the road a bit, and she usually keeps her lights on. She doesn't like all the lost souls roaming around. Can't say that I blame her. Oh, she's, she's adorable. Sure. First... What level am I? I'm a level four. Still a thirdist. Ooh, that looks awesome. Yeah, let's wear that. Okay. Look at me. I match. Look at that. Look at that on my chest. A symbol. All right. So what are we doing again? Oh yeah, we gotta visit. We gotta visit. Uh, whatever her name is. I already forgot. Look for a light lit in, lit up house. Oh look, there it is. That's right, they haven't moved. She hasn't moved in a while. Which is good to hear. Hello, Dorothy. That's your name, okay. Oh, hello. You say that Private Conley was worried about me? He always does fret so. 
I'm all right. But I wish someone could do something about all those ghosts outside. Sometimes I wish Auntie M could join me here. I'd feel better with her around. Say, I was having my friends over for dinner, but they are running late. I fear for their sake with all those ghosts roaming around. Could you check up on them? My two friends live on this street, down towards the park area. Look for a house with a light on in the window. You can't miss it. Sure. Let's do it. Knock, knock. What? You say that Dorothy is looking for us? Uh -huh. We were just about to be on our way. You're, uh, uh, yeah, Tin Man. Oh, I told you we should have left earlier. Now we've gone and made her worry about us. Oh. I'm sorry, but I cannot find my oil can. You wouldn't want me season up on the way there. Oh, we can't have that now, can we? Oh dear, we always go through this. Can you return to Dorothy and tell her we'll be running late as usual? Uh-oh. I will do that. Mr. Toto and Tin Man. Your... her friends. I look ghost. I ain't afraid of no ghosts. Dorothy! Back with news. Hello. They are safe and sound. It's good to know that they are just running late. Now I won't have to worry. I always fear a wicked witch might show up and whisk them back to her castle. This land is so strange. Not like back at the farm. Really? You used to live on a farm? You're all schnazzed up. Look at this. But I do like it here. Headmaster Ambrose is such a nice wizard. And my new friends are nice too. I'd say that in all... This place is as fun as a barrel of flying monkeys! Mm. Would you say hello to Private Connolly for me? Oh, sure. Oh, he's down here. Duh. I went the wrong way. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. Someone's got a little pogo stick. That's adorable. Glad to hear Dorothy is doing well. Yes, she is. That's it! Awesome! What in the world are you doing? I bet you're having fun on that thing. Oh, yeah! This is something I gotta do in here. That's right. I gotta look at all these things. Come on. You can simply click on the practice pedestal to create a duel or to accept another wizard's challenge. Uh-huh. Practice tools are not reported and do not affect your PvP rating, but they are a fantastic way to hone your skills. Ooh, very nice. Okay, this one. Compete as a ranked duelist. Click on the ranked pedestal to create a challenge or to accept another wizard's challenge. Uh -huh. You have the chance to win arena tickets, which you can redeem for prizes. Awesome. A little more? And every win will increase your PvP rating. However, if you lose or flee a duel, your PvP rating will go down. Oh, sad. Okay. Number three. The tournament pedestal will let you join tournaments, but you must reach level 10 before you can use it. Okay. You can win special prizes by competing in tournaments. I will tell you more about them when you are ready. Okay. Next. The leaderboard pedestal allows you to see your standings. It shows you how your rating compares to other duelists. Mm -hmm. Each season of Wizard vs. Wizard duels is known as an age. The length of an age is something of a mystery. Interesting. Every time a new age begins, the leaderboard standings are annulled to give every wizard another chance to shine. 
Very nice. Oh, it shines. Talk to Diego. Okay. As I should have done this before, but they're like, Oh, you entered a, a, an area that isn't ready for you yet. Go somewhere else. Now you know how to duel another wizard for practice or for ranked status. Uh -huh. Don't forget to bring your arena tickets here to redeem for fantastic rewards. Okay. And remember, the ranked PvP rating lasts for an age. Once a new age begins, everyone's rating starts at zero. Oh, really? Oh, God. Awesome! Alright, well, I'm gonna have to end this video here. That was very interesting. I think we're done on Unicorn Way, though. I think. Let me do a little bit more exploring to see if there are any, um... Anything I can pick up. Yeah, there's usually something I can pick up in the waters here. Oh, you can see little fishes in there, don't ya? Okay, so there's nothing right now. Oh, that makes me so sad. Nothing over here? Okay, nothing over here. Alright, well, I'll see you guys in the next episode then. Bye!